All right, I will start off this video by saying it is kind of clickbait, but once I explain the story, then you'll understand what I mean, okay, guys? I am currently employed at my local gas station, okay? That's where I work. I work as a sales associate. Basically, I just work the cash register, and I help customers with whatever questions and stuff that they need help with, okay? Well, uh, it was what, middle of November or something? Somewhere between September and November, okay? But it wasn't Halloween week, okay? Now, remember that key point, okay? It is not Halloween week, okay? It is one of the nights, though, during somewhere between September and November. And I'm working, it's dark outside, so it's around like 7 or 8, maybe even slightly earlier. But I'm working, it's the usual night, nothing really bad, wrong is going on, nothing weird is happening, which is weird, considering it's a Friday night at my gas station, and something always goes wrong, something weird always happens, I've had people shit on the floor, I've had people steal Snoop Dogg alcohol, um, I've had people ask me if we've got gas at a gas station, so it's a bit weird that nothing weird has happened yet that night, okay, however, I'm just working, and I'm, like, bent over, and I'm cleaning something below the right shirt, okay, whatever. And I hear someone walking through the door, so I pop up, and I go, hello, and I, like, look around, and I don't see anyone. I'm like, okay, that's weird. So I turn around to go look at the other door, and someone was walking through that door. So I was like, hello, uh, blah, 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 did my normal, like, intro thing for them, um, and then as soon as I finished that, Another person walks in through the door, but it was through the other door that I originally looked at. So I turn around and I go, hello. And it, you wouldn't believe what I saw. It was a dude dressed as Michael Jackson moonwalking into my store. And he just moonwalks in, spins around and goes, hee hee. And uh, I, I'm just shocked. I can't say anything because I'm like, what, what is going on? And I'm like, Hi, uh, how are you doing tonight? He's like, I'm doing great, man. How are you? <laughs> and I'm trying really hard not to laugh because he like popped his knee, did the little pose too. And I'm like, I love this dude already. I, I've only talked to him for like 30 seconds. I don't love him. So I, I start talking to him, uh, being like, oh, I'm having a good night, blah, blah, blah. I love your outfit, by the way. I love Michael Jackson. He's like, oh, man. So do I, man. Michael Jackson's great. <laughs> At that point, I had chuckled. I was like, oh, really? You like Michael Jackson? I couldn't tell. And he's walking, like, towards the back of the store. My guess is for the bathroom. And, yeah, he basically walks up to the bathroom door and just says, I'm going to use the bathroom real quick. I'll be right back. I'm like, okay, I'll be out here, man. And I'm chuckling. I'm like, just... Whenever you need me, just come on up here, and I'll be here. He's like, okay, man, I got you. <laughs> and so he walks into the bathroom, okay? And he's in there for a couple minutes. I'm just, like, making sure that he's all right. And I continue doing my work. I continue helping other customers. Well, five minutes go by. Ten minutes go by. Now, remind you, I've had someone sit in that bathroom for 30 minutes. They were stealing something, but the longest I've had someone sit in the bathroom was for 30 minutes. So I was like, okay, 10 minutes is a bit long, but like, whatever, maybe he's constipated. Maybe he's really got to do a fat dookie, you know? I'm not going to judge. Maybe his bladder is really full. Like I said, I'm not going to judge, okay? Well, then 15 minutes go by, and then 20 minutes go by, and my coworker comes out from the back, and I'm like, hey, weird question, but have you seen Michael Jackson? And my coworker is looking at me like I'm nuts. And I'm like, I'm going to take that look on your face as a no. Uh, could you go back on the cameras and look for Michael Jackson? Because, like, tr believe me, okay, trust me. Michael Jackson, well, not actually Michael Jackson, but a person dressed as Michael Jackson walked into the store 20 minutes ago and went into the bathroom and either disappeared or he's still taken off fat shit in the bathroom, and he's been in there for 20 minutes, and I'm just, I'll be honest, I'm slightly concerned, because I have not seen that man walk out of that bathroom yet, and it's been 20 minutes, so my co is like, e yeah, but uh, someone dressed as Michael Jackson 
came into the store, walked into the bathroom, and disappeared. I'm like, yeah. I'm like, trust me, believe me. I. Why would I make something like this up? Like, you. Out of all the weird stories I've told you, you don't trust me on me seeing a Michael Jackson impersonator walk into the store and then just disappear like Michael Jackson. And my cookie's like, I mean, I believe you, but like, where is he? I'm like, he's in the bathroom. Maybe. I don't know. He hasn't walked out yet. I don't. Maybe he left. I don't know. Maybe he crawled through the ceiling and just went away. I don't know what happened to him. So my cookie's like, Okay, so she walks up to the bathroom, knocks on the door, no one answers, and my coworker is like, you sure someone came into the bathroom? I'm like, yes, you can literally look at the cameras, go back, go back 20 minutes on the camera, someone walked into the bathroom, and they're like, okay, so they reach for the handle, they open the door, wide open, for them to see who's in there, and for me to see who's in there. No one's in the bathroom. Nothing. There's no sign that anyone was in the bathroom. And my coworker is just looking at me like, bro, you need to go home. You need some sleep. I'm, I'm like freaking out because I'm like, there is no way someone dressed as Michael Jackson walked into the store, walked into the bathroom, and somehow left without me ever noticing. And I, I was above the counter, like my head was above the counter, for majority of that time. So, and facing the door that he would have left through. Two. So, it's like, I would have saw him leave. But I never saw him leave. And it, it still creeps me out to this day. Because I've never seen that man again. Never. And I, I don't know if I was just hallucinating the entire thing. I couldn't have. Because another customer, the only other customer in the store at the time, was like, what the fuck is he wearing? And I'm like, he's Michael Jackson, man. What do you mean? He, what is he wearing? And I'm like, okay, weirdo. So, like, I have an eyewitness that Michael Jackson did come into my store. However, that customer left before Michael Jackson ever left the bathroom. If he ever did leave the bathroom, maybe he just used an escape rope and left. Maybe he used teleportation jitsu. Maybe he just went back to his grave. I don't know. Maybe it was his ghost. I... I don't know. A weird retail story for you guys. So, yeah, that's the time that I met Michael Jackson and he just disappeared on me, never to be seen again.